I, I think I'm definitely losing it because I went to a wrong meeting, so I was wondering why nobody is in the class and whether the inevitable has happened the day when nobody will show up. So, uh, I don't know, I need some compassion. All of us will need compassion in a week, but uh, I've been bullied by a mathematician. How dare you? It's, it's a long story. Long time ago, I became an editor of a journal called Nonlinearity which was uh, created to be a meeting ground between mathematicians and physicists. So the idea was that mathematicians will make an effort to be understood by physics audience of the journal and the physicists would make an effort to read mathematics style paper. So a colleague and group of students in my spell spent several years trying to explain what chaos means in a field theory, not just for a few degrees of freedom, but for continuum. And um, so we wrote a paper after a few years, and it's very difficult because it has original ideas in it. That's extremely painful for any reader. And uh, after one year, almost, 10 months, a referee report came and it strongly objected to us using words like uh, state or field and demands that we rewrite the paper so we, for example, when you say Maxwell field or electrostatic field, you're wrong. You should be saying, I'm studying function uh, E of X. <laughs> so it's not Maxwell field, it's Maxwell function. And it should be written either as a theorem or a conjecture, otherwise it cannot be published in a decent journal. So I'm just being bullied by guys that have learned some weird language. And now they think that because Hilbert uh, mathematicized them, all of us should be speaking in terms of functions, etc. And you know, technically it's true. I mean, uh, it is true that electromagnetic field is a function of something, but it's totally useless because that's not how we think and we're trying to help them learn how we think and vice versa. So that's my terrible situation. But I will, instead of that, I'll entertain you with a bunch of videos and please interrupt like you always do, and not just that one guy, but for example, Sarah or anybody, because it really helps us all. I mean, it very much focuses me when you ask me a question, because you know, I'm taking you to excursion to a really vast field, symmetries, you know. Much of physics is about symmetries. So it's very good to focus on essential, and you help me.